Me and my wife and my mother-in-law were driving through Texas back to Arkansas. I pulled into a big rest stop because we all needed to, you know what, a real bad. My mother-in-law's nearly blind as a bat. She picked up a skunk, thinking it was a cat. She said, pretty kitty, you're so nice. That skunk let her have it right between the eyes. He was a good shot. She picked the wrong bathroom to wash her face. Truckers came stampeding out of the place. I told my wife, you can bet your hat, she ain't riding in my car smelling like that. No way. The park attendant gave us a hose. We sprayed her down and burned her clothes with a brand new dress and a different purse. She looked okay, but the smell got worse. It was rain. Another tourist who happened along said spray her with some real cold Pepsi foam. We bought a bunch of Pepsi, shook them real good, and started spraying her down from head to foot. Oh, she didn't like it. When we hit her hot body with that ice cold mess, Clouds of steam billowed out of her dress. A preacher pulled up long about then. He said, leave her alone, don't you know that's a sin? And so is cussing, ma'am. The Pepsi dried out, but the smell came back. I said, Ma, you got a right on the luggage rack. Ma only weighs about 100 pounds, but it took six truckers to strap her down. She didn't want to get up there. We tied her face down with her head to the rear so she wouldn't get bugs in her eyes and her ears. I don't think she noticed the compassion we showed. We got in the car and headed down the road. It was a bad scene. Oh, we're rolling now. How you doing up there, Ma? Stop kicking, you did my roof. My wife was berserk and going wild. I said she'll let her out in a few more miles. I finally pulled into another rest stop because we all needed to, you know what, again. There wasn't much left to Ma's new dress. Her shoes were gone and her hair was a mess. After 60 miles in the wind and the heat, there was layers of bugs on the soles of her feet, real thick. Well, needless to say, she was a terrible sight, but I took a whiff and she smelled all right. I loosened the straps and set her on the ground, dodging her attempts to knock me down. She was a little perturbed. I said, you're fresh as a daisy, my plan worked, Ma. Ain't you proud of your son-in-law? Ma, that preacher said cussing's a sin. If you don't cut it out, you're on the rack again. <laughs>